Hey there, curious minds. This 19th century inventor is the reason we can light up our lives using alternating current. It is the Serbian American inventor, Nikola Tesla. But his life story is a roller coaster of innovation coupled with bad fortune. In this video, we will take you on an express journey where we'll demystify Tesla's groundbreaking contributions to science, his quirky inventions, and the controversies that fueled his journey. So, let's have a look at his life and everything that made him what he is. If you've ever seen a brilliant mind suffer due to lack of resources, wait till you hear the life story of Nikola Tesla. Nikola Tesla was born in 1856 in present-day Croatia. He was gifted with photographic memory, which allowed him to recite entire books from memory and memorize complex mathematical calculations easily. This extraordinary ability would later be of great use in his scientific breakthroughs. At a young age, Tesla's fascination with electricity grew, and his mathematical talents astounded teachers, who wrongly suspected that he was cheating. But they only had a genius enrolled, that's all. Tesla's journey led him to the Imperial Royal Technical College in Graz, Austria, where his passion for electricity blossomed. You would think a prodigy like him would flourish in college, right? But was this the case? Unfortunately, no. Tesla left the college in 1878 at age 22, and some suggest he may have been expelled due to his gambling habits that led to losing all his tuition money. His life also lacked any romance. You know why? Well, according to him, any relationship would distract from his work, and he even claimed that he was not worthy of women. If only women knew how important this man is going to be in the coming century. Tesla was fascinated by the thought of electromagnetic fields and alternate current motor. He got a job in Hungary at the Budapest Telephone Exchange in 1881, working under Tividar Puskas, the inventor of the telephone exchange. Later, he relocated to Paris in 1882, where he impressed the Continental Edison Company with his skills and was assigned to troubleshoot engineering challenges across France and Germany. In 1884, he immigrated to the United States, joining the Edison Machine Works in Manhattan, New York. However, just six months later, he abruptly quit his job. But why? The exact reason remains unclear but it could have been due to an unpaid bonus or a shelved project. Some versions of the story even claim that Thomas Edison himself backed out of a deal with him. Yep, the inventor of the light bulb. In fact, Edison is known to be a solid competitor to Tesla, and he will remain one later in the story too. Liking the video so far? Please press the like button to let us know and subscribe to our channel for more informative videos on history like this. Now let's continue. Tesla went on to establish the Tesla Electric Light and Manufacturing Company with the backing of investors, but couldn't hold on to them. In 1886, they abandoned him in financial ruin and without control over his patents. He still kept on working on an alternating current motor and, in 1888, sold his patent to industrialist George Westinghouse. Westinghouse Electric Company had quickly become a competitor of Thomas Edison, who was a supporter of direct current. In another attempt to fulfill his vision of wireless power transmission, Tesla's plan to build the Wardenclyffe Tower grew more ambitious, aiming to surpass Guglielmo Marconi's radio system. He sought investors in New York, securing $150,000 from J.P. Morgan against a 51% share of any generated wireless patents. He kept approaching Morgan for additional funds, but was denied, leading to the project's eventual collapse in 1905. He even faced a mental breakdown at that moment. Now let me tell you a lesser known fact about Tesla's rivalry with Thomas Edison. Edison waged a propaganda war against Tesla's alternating current to make his direct current the standard electricity system. To prove alternating current was more deadly, they electrocuted animals in public with it and even suggested using it for severe punishments like life sentences. But guess what? Edison's methods backfired. George Westinghouse, who bought the patent for the alternating current from Tesla, snatched a contract to power the 1893 World's Fair in Chicago, leaving Edison's General Electric in the dust. The Expo became a dazzling stage for Tesla's alternating current system, proving that flashy campaigns don't always work. Fun fact, Elon Musk's groundbreaking automobile company Tesla is in fact a tribute to Nikola Tesla and his pioneering work in electrical engineering. 
So every time you see a Tesla on the road, you're witnessing a nod to the past. Now, let's have a look at some of Tesla's most important inventions. Alternating Current Power Tesla is most credited with creating the first ever alternating current motor, or AC. AC is fantastic for long distance transmission, and it's the same current that we get through the power outlets in our homes. Thanks to Tesla's innovations, AC power can be sent over hundreds of miles with minimal loss. Tesla Coil In 1891, he invented this two-coil system called Tesla Coil that generates high-voltage, low-current electricity. Beyond its flashy appearances in science fiction, the Tesla Coil was practically used in early radio transmission systems and played a role in powering early fluorescent lights. Magnifying Transmitter to transmit electrical energy across great distances without wires, he made an advanced version of his Tesla coil that could produce millions of volts of electricity called magnifying transmitter. Tesla even reported being able to light a field of bulbs at a distance of a kilometer using this device. Do you remember the Wardenclyffe Tower we talked about? That project did include elements of his magnifying transmitter design. Tesla Turbine Tesla turbine is a special kind of turbine that doesn't have traditional spinning blades like a piston engine. It is bladeless and uses smooth discs that spin in a chamber using combusted fuel that enters the chamber. It's quite a simple yet effective design, often used in different areas like generating power or propelling things forward. Shadow Graph Now, we all know about x-rays, right? And that Wilhelm Röntgen was the man behind their discovery. But hold on to your hats because it is said that our man Tesla knew about them already before Röntgen publicly identified them in 1895. Tesla called these rays radiant energy. After learning about Röntgen's discovery, he did his own experiments and generated an X-ray photograph of a shoe, which he called a shadow graph, using his own vacuum tube. Radio What? Wasn't Guglielmo Marconi the inventor? Well, not exactly. The inventor title of the radio is a bit disputed, you see, in the late 19th century, both Tesla and Marconi were racing to develop radio technology. However, Tesla's lab fire tragically destroyed critical research papers, stalling his progress. Meanwhile, Marconi, with strong financial backing and support from aristocrats and Thomas Edison, made a breakthrough in 1904 using some of Tesla's patents and successfully sent a signal across the Atlantic Ocean. His patent approval for the radio marked him as its inventor. Although Tesla attempted to sue Marconi's company, he lacked the resources to battle a major corporation in court. Neon Lamp Tesla figured out how to bend and mold neon tubes into words and shapes, turning them into the eye-catching signs we know today. When he first presented everyone with his neon signs at the 1893 Chicago World's Fair, it was an instant hit. Hydroelectric Power Niagara Falls may be a beautiful natural site, but it was more than that for Tesla, who saw the great potential for energy generation here. So, along with George Westinghouse, they created the world's first hydroelectric power plant at Niagara Falls. Guess who they beat in the 1893 contest organized by the International Niagara Falls Commission? Yep, Thomas Edison. Induction Motor In 1887, Tesla introduced the induction motor which is another groundbreaking invention of his that still serves as the foundation for the motors we use today, like in vacuums, blow dryers, and power tools. Modern motors incorporate advanced materials, better manufacturing techniques, and improved efficiency, but the basic principle of generating a rotating magnetic field with polyphase current, as conceived by Tesla, remains the same. Radio-controlled boat in 1898, Nikola Tesla presented his radio-controlled boat at an electrical exhibition at Madison Square Garden in New York, which was a first at the time, and he called it Tele-Automation. His exhibition proved that you can control things using radio waves without needing to be near them. So, while Nikola Tesla's life may be full of achievements, he was poor, depressed, and abandoned towards the end of his life. He struggled to get the funding for his projects and the recognition he deserved throughout his lifetime. But it wasn't until after his death that he gained broader recognition. Now, he has been immortalized as one of the greatest and most important inventors to have ever lived. What do you think of Nikola Tesla? Which of his inventions do you think is the most important one for the world today? Tell us in the comments. Share the video with others, and if you haven't already, do consider liking and subscribing to our channel.
Thanks for watching everyone, and we'll see you in another video very soon.